In today's video, I'll be giving you a complete breakdown of the platform Easy Crypto. I'll be showing you all the steps from setting up an account to making your first investment and an exact step-by-step -step guide on what the whole process would look like to actually purchase your very own cryptocurrency using the platform. Firstly, what is Easy Crypto? It's a New Zealand exclusive cryptocurrency exchange that allows you to buy the vast majority of cryptocurrency. You can buy very recognizable ones like Ethereum and Bitcoin and then more up-and-coming currencies like XRP and Cardona. It's compatible with virtually all software and hardware wallets like the ones made by Trezor and Ledger. It allows you to send and receive cryptocurrency, track your portfolio and withdraw money directly into your own bank account. So how do you set up an account? You'll just need a few things like your IRD number and proof of identity either in the form of your driver's license or passport number and then just a verified bank statement. It takes a few days for that to get processed and then you'll be nice and ready with your own easy crypto account. There is a partial age restriction on using easy crypto but you are able to have an account if you're under 18 you just have to email their help desk and they'll sort things out for you if you are interested in using easy crypto i'll leave an affiliate link down below in the description that you can use when you first sign up to get yourself a discount remember if you find value in this video make sure to help me out and leave a like on the video as well so just jumping onto easy crypto i'll give you a guide of what the platform looks like and then some of the features that it's got so one of the great features about easy crypto is that it has a track which tracks your portfolio and the coins that you've purchased using the platform. It's only accurate to what you've done on Easy Crypto if you've purchased coins from another exchange. There's also an option to add the type of currency that you bought. You'll just scroll down to the bottom and then you can click on add a trade and then select the date, how much you invested, the value of it, then it'll add that into your portfolio as well. You can see a nice outline of the coins that I've currently got. So I've got Ethereum, Cardona, Bitcoin and XRP. If we scroll up to the top, it gives you a nice overview about how much you've invested, the value of your portfolio and the overall return that you've made. A nice daily and weekly change as well. And then a corresponding graph that gives you an overview of how much your portfolio has changed. You can look at each individual currency, how many coins you have and the percentage gain and how much profit you've made from it. And then a nice overview of your overall stats again at the bottom. So from the home screen as well, if you scroll down and you can look at some of the most popular coins in the market, you've got Bitcoin, Ethereum, Cardona, at the top you can look at the vast majority of cryptocurrencies if you're actually wanting to purchase some cryptocurrency using easy crypto then you're going to also need a wallet to store your coins on but easy crypto is compatible with hardware wallets like the ones made by ledger and trezor but these can be quite expensive ranging from anywhere to 120 to 200 dollars plus so that can put people off if they're just getting started and there's already that quite large lump sum payment you have to give up just to even begin investing in crypto so the best option that i would recommend especially if you're a beginner is getting a free software wallet called exodus it gives you a lot of security features not found on an exchange so you never want to leave your coins on the exchange you purchase them from you always want to export them over to a wallet so with exodus it's tied to a unique password made by yourself and then a set of security phrases that you use if you happen to forget your password it's not tied to a specific email address the same way that your login on an exchange Exchange is so it gives you a lot of that security with your coins and limits their chances of being stolen so if you're wanting to actually purchase some cryptocurrency using easy crypto just click on instant buy or sell and then select the amount of New Zealand dollar you're wanting to transfer into whatever cryptocurrency that you're purchasing for this example I'll use Bitcoin with Bitcoin there's a minimum purchase amount of 100 New Zealand dollars so I'll pop that in up the top here and then click on buy now and then it'll give you a summary of the order and then it'll ask for a delivery address and this is where the wallet that you have comes in because the wallet that you own whether it be software or hardware will have a unique delivery address that is specific to you which you will need to copy and paste into here now it's a set of digits and numbers and this needs to be copied correctly otherwise your coins will be sent to somebody else's wallet so you'll need to jump over to exodus or any crypto wallet that you're currently using search the currency that you're trying to buy click on receive because you're getting the currency sent from the exchange easy crypto over to the wallet and then copy and paste that unique code over into your easy crypto account make sure the first digit or number is exactly the same on your wallet as it is on easy crypto just to make sure that 
nobody else is getting access to those coins. After that, you want to click on next step down the bottom, then it'll give you a few different payment options. So all of these involve either paying directly with a bank transfer, logging in through your specific bank, and then paying with a credit card. So there's account to account, instant and free, poly payment, which is again instant, but it might have a fee of up to $3 because it depends on what time you place the order and what time the banks are open for that order to get processed. So that one supports virtually all banks with the bank deposit and then all major New Zealand banks are supported by account to account or poly payment. Once you've gone through with that, depending on what payment option you go with, the coins will either be in your account instantly or virtually the following day. So you'll get a confirmation email that looks like this saying that the coins are on their way or that they have arrived in your wallet and then you'll be able to see them on your corresponding wallet. So here's my Exodus wallet. You can see some of the transactions that I've made using Easy Crypto. If I've skipped over things too quickly and you want a bit more advice on buying cryptocurrency in New Zealand, then check out these videos on screen. It'll show you the two best wallets that you can use, either a free software wallet or one of the better paid options that you can go with as well. Check those videos out to save you a bit of time and see which option is best for you.